All right, fans of Prince TV, I'm making this video as at the time of um, 1.39, which is to 2 o'clock, midnight to 2. Now that they make this video now, so just to keep it early morning so that people will get to listen. Very, very vital and then important information for you guys to know that Italy have passed a law which they have slot already into their official gazette stating that Nigeria in particular is a safe country to be so people don't have to request for asylum not just only nigeria other nationalities have been mentioned but they use nigeria as a case study for the illustration of the hypothesis so people have to now listen you guys have to listen and know what they have stated already you that don't have documents yet you have to listen to this video to the end and those people who are planning to arrive in italy you guys have to listen this particular news they have published it and then they have made it as a law. Prince TV is here to interpret or to give it out to people out there to not get to know what is going on here in Italy. Now listen attentively. He said here, from today, Nigeria is considered a safe country of origin. He said the rules for migrants from the African nation change. He said the Fanasina decree does not provide for exemption for the regions where Boko Haram is ranging. Now listen to what they are now stating. He said here, from today, Italy considers Nigeria a safe country of origin. The inclusion of Nigeria was decided by a decree of the foreign ministry dated 17 March, published today in the official Gazette. Like as I'm talking to you guys, they have already published this news. They make all this a decree since on the 17th of March, nobody knows. Now, now they bring a comma for news and then which they have slotted in the official gazette italy is now considering nigeria as a safe country to stay so now listen let's go a little bit forward he said how is a safe country of origin defined this is a question he said here a non-eu state can be considered a safe country of origin if on the basis of its legal system the application of the law within a or democratic system and the general political situation he said here it can be demonstrated that in general and constant there are no acts of persecution as defined by article 7 of legislative decree 19 november 20, 2007 number 251 no torture or other form of punishment or inhuman or degrading treatment nor danger due to indiscriminate violence in situation of internal or international armed conflict so now that's stating that where the law is stated that place will be like say no danger nothing they pursue you you know if you come out say you won't call they seek asylum now that they consider nigeria as one of the country that they don't have to go out to seek for asylum say nigeria they save now, which is a try to the state for this particular part. Now, listen to what the nasty stating. He said, The designation of a safe country of origin can be made with the exemption of parts of the territory or categories of persons. He said, The decree makes no reference to the region of Nigeria where Boko Haram rigs. He said, The list of safe country of origin is notified to the EU Commission. Now, let me break it down. Even as the they make Nigeria as a safe country where they consider, say yes, no need to go seek for asylum, they also stated that areas where Boko Haram are operating, all those north side, yes, those regions have to also be put into consideration as hypotheses. So when they try to talk now, they say, if, for example, you be Nigerian person, you go seek asylum from Italy, they go check where you for the come. They examine your case. All these things they don't put them for that under EU Commission. So that is what they are now stating. Now, listen to the following country considered as a safe country uh, in Africa. I did make this video for night as at the two o'clock. So my voice feels this song I'm gonna know best. And listen to the countries which they have mentioned. He said here, the following are considered safe country of origin. He said Albania, Algeria, Bosnia, Cape Verde, Abu Coast. Gambia, Georgia, Ghana, Kosovo, or North uh, Medicina, Morocco, then Nigeria, Senegal, Serbia, Tunisia. He said, for the purpose of exam, examining application for 
international protection. Now, they mention all these African countries to be a safe country where people can stay. The EU, even Italian government itself, they make research, they now see that all these countries being mentioned here as safe country for people to stay without going out to seek for international protection. Let me read it again. He said, for the purposes of examining applications for international protection, the inclusion of Côte d'Ivoire, Gambia, Georgia, and Nigeria is the list of safe countries of origin has no effect on application submitted by the national um, of these uh, countries before the adoption of this decree. Now, let me explain this part. Now, what did the state for here be saying? These countries where they mention this uh, code over uh, Gambia, Georgia, and Nigeria say people were already seek for asylum before this decree go into force. Now, these people, they feel still get right to get document, no matter how they taste, they say the place where they for take come, they save. Then, starting from now, if you are from this country, I talk to my people in Nigeria, in particular, Senegal, Gambia, Ghana, Serbia, you know, and the rest, Gambians, they are not stating that, starting from now, these countries are safe place to stay without coming to seek for asylum. But they only mention that Nigeria, uh, Cote d'Ivoire, Gambia, and Georgia are the only country they are going to consider for documents who have already arrived here. So that is what they have stated. This one are the article of the news. Prince TV is just here to keep it out for people to now know that Italy have passed a law in the slotted in the official gazette stating that this African countries which I just mentioned is a safe place to stay without coming to seek for asylum. So now see, every day this is they pass law. They just passed a law relating to special protection which state that you cannot apply again. Now, they are now fishing at some African country which they have considered on their own as a safe place to stay. And they use Nigeria as illustration and that is a case study. So make one let me know what you are think for this video. If it makes sense, what did they just do? Let me know because now they say Nigeria they save, but the hypothesis of Nigeria as a country in particular, they got the state say you won't come from the area where Boko Haram they exist where where they physically consider you. So that is you have to categorize it according to the state where you for take command. So that is just it. Prince TV wish to let people to know and make a pay sacrifice to wake up around two o'clock just to dress up like this to give out this information. You cannot say any morning. I know go day around and be seen at the evening again and I won't make the news circulate past so that people go listening to. So what you go do for me for this kind of sacrifice, waking up by two o'clock is to give me tons of and then you share this video so that everybody get to listen. I greet all the fans of Prince TV. Respect.